What do you know about beta blockers? Do you know the differences? There are cardioselective and non-cardioselective beta blockers. Cardioselective beta blockers act primarily on beta-1 more so than on beta-2 receptors. So they typically won't trigger someone's asthma or worsen their asthma as much as non-cardioselective beta blockers would. Examples of the cardioselective class are atenolol, bisoprolol, and metoprolol. Non-selective beta blockers, such as carvedilol and labetalol, they also tend to block alpha receptors, which make them a better blood pressure lowering agent. Propranolol is a non-selective beta blocker that blocks both beta-1 and beta-2 receptors alike, and it's also very lipid-soluble, so it can also be used to treat anxiety, migraine, headaches, tremors, and stage fright. Do you know the antidote to beta blocker overdose? Glucagon or inotropes, positive inotropes such as dobutamine. Hope this was helpful.